Hey guys, Brenny here, and welcome to another hardcore. As you can see, I am level 35, so we're going to be enchanting this axe because I want to see what I get. Uh, because I, I've been using like stone axes and, and I've been using my pickaxe to break trees. Uh, from the previous episode, one of these blocks was wrong, so I fixed it. Uh, a few other little things was there was a block here placed wrong and it was messing with the redstone and there was a block removed from when the creeper blew up. Uh, but in this episode, I think we'll be doing this little nether area, uh, and maybe working on the tree farm. I also want to get, um, a, what, it, what is it called again? I forgot what it's called. Uh, it's not too bad, I suppose. Uh, an emerald block, and, and we need to get some dark wood, so that's probably what I'll do now. Uh, I feel, I actually have a story on mine that I, um, was speaking to a friend about in a live stream, and I think I could speak about that during this live, sh uh, well, not live stream, during this video. Uh, so yeah, let's get on that. Uh, I've got food, got armor, got an axe, uh, got a pickaxe. What we need to do is find a hill biome. Do I have my little compass on me? I think what we'll do is we'll just go the opposite direction of my compass. So we'll put that there. And we'll make it face straight down and then we'll just run that way until we generate new map. And then once we've done that, oh, we need to take a nap. Anyway, guys, so the random ass story I wanted to speak about was the talk, like the sex talk. So, um, before me and Crystal were together, she was... I, it was Wednesday, she used to, Crystal's my girlfriend for newer viewers that don't know even though I crap on about her like every video. Uh, but yeah, Crystal was coming over on Wednesdays, so that's because we had a half day at school and she liked me and I liked her. So that is basically, she'd come over to my house and would hang out. Uh, now that's all normal, nothing really messed up there. But she eventually started sleeping over and sleeping in my bed with me. Uh, this is still before going out. I don't know, right? She's an idiot. Young slut money right now. Um, <laughs> uh, but yeah, we weren't really doing anything. But the fact that sh I had like a girl sleeping over nearly like every weekend. Um, my granddad thought, oh, because I um, grew up mainly with my mum, my granddad thought, oh, I should probably try to make sure Brendan's using protection. So what my granddad's done is walked in front of the doorway one day when I was uh, out in our back room doing the laundry because we have the washing machine in there. And he's um, blocked the doorway and started speaking to me about like protection and like sex. And it was just so awkward. So I'm like trying to like climb out in between his arms to get out of the door because like it wasn't the fact like I, I'm I was maturish back then I wouldn't say I was super mature I'm a fair bit more mature now but I knew I knew all the info I knew about sex I knew, I've always been smart too I feel like my granddad feels that like I'm m gonna make bad moves but I've never really made a bad move I haven't done drugs I haven't I didn't drink until I was 18 uh, and that I have had offers obviously for all of those things but of course, I'm not going to do that stuff, because that's just how I want to live. Oh, wow! Oh my god, that looks stupidly funny. Uh, but yeah, I just, my personal preference, that wasn't something I wanted to do, so I didn't do it. And, like, I had uh, a YouTube buddy, we'll call him, I think that's possibly the best name for him, come over to, uh, I met him for the first time, his name's Rai Rai, and, like, I asked him, uh, do you have your license? Um, we'll go out for a drive. And he said, yes. So I, I was like, all right, let's go. We drove around in my car. And my granddad still felt the need to ask, like, hey, do you have your license? And like made him prove it. And it's like, I'm not, I don't know. I feel like my granddad feels I'm, like I'm quite stupid. But this area is badass. Look at this thing. This thing is, this ha we have to make this into something eventually, guys, here. What are my coordinates? You guys remember that. Actually, I can use this video as a reference one day. Uh, but yeah, we need to find some dark wood. Ooh, we have a beach over here, which is good. Um, uh, it's I, I kind of wanted more beach area in my world. But yeah, what I'm going to do, guys, is continue running around, adventuring uh, in this d direction, looking for a um, new spawned area, because I still don't think this is newly gener generated. Can't really tell. I think they should add that, like, what uh, update the game this area you're standing in was generated because that would make um like getting new areas a lot easier you wouldn't walk too far you wouldn't walk too little uh so yeah i'll be back guys 
So I found some trees, uh, some dark wood trees and some dark wood here. Oh, spruce wood. Uh, anyway, so I was looking for emerald and I, I knew I was in a new biome because I could see the trees were naturally spawning with uh, wood facing this way on some of them. Uh, so I knew I was in like the good area, but I couldn't find any and I was digging. I think it's level 30 you meant to dig at and I knew I was in a hills biome and I know you find them in hills biomes. Uh, but I couldn't find any so I was like screw it because either way I didn't have a silk touch pickaxe on me and we need to get one of them so we can actually take the block all by itself uh, So yeah, oh don't need to shoot the chicken mate. I'm on my way home uh, So I suppose we'll just do the tree farm and we'll do the we've got to eventually get the um, The emerald in there though because that that was like I was really excited when they added emeralds because I was like finally now I do have a block for there where is my area, guys? Look at this. This is map, like, generation code changing in front of our eyes. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to go back to my home area, make it daytime, and then I think we'll pimp out a little tree farm that looks quite pretty. I think my area is near here somewhere. I feel like this mountain is known. I know that mountain. But yeah, I'll be back, guys. So we're back and I have planted the trees and I have extra saplings. A creeper blew up one of the trees. I sh should have probably brought more with me. But yeah, it's good to know that I have a source of dark wood now. Um, I probably should shear some sheep and collect some wood and just do things that like I don't have much of. I was going to be doing the piston entrance to my nether room and then I realized see where the creeper blew up. Uh, then I realized I didn't have much uh, stone bricks or whatever. What are the nether bricks called? Nether stone bricks? I don't know what they're actually called. Uh, so I'm going to have to go get some of them, which is going to be excellent to do. I'm really looking forward to that. And this keeps happening to me, guys. Like, the Minecraft server thing just can't keep up with me. And because, like, this isn't a server for the people that for some reason will think this is a server now. Um, it's just not keeping up recently, which is annoying. Maybe I should run it with more RAM. It's another sucky thing about efficiency. I can dig dirt with it. Uh, but that's good now. Like, we have those trees, these trees, and these trees. Uh, what is it? Br spruce? Oak and birch. Oh, no, these ones are spruce? What are the... Oh, they're birch. Birch, oak, and spruce. Uh, now what I want to do is have, like... Maybe... How should I mark it? Should have... We'll break this down now. It's just to make my life easier because I want to have a chest for every type of wood instead of just this weird like chest stack thing I have here. Oh, didn't know I did that. Um, what we should do is have it like that and then like that maybe. Or we could have the um, smithed version or whatever it is, or crafted version, refined wood, there it is. And then we can have the wood there maybe, uh, the chest there. I don't really know. Um, we'll have a look at that. Like so. There. And need to dig some dirt with my um, axe. Put the dirt here. And there. I think that's how I'll have them. And then I'll have one there and then one there. But yeah, I'm going to do that. Then I'm going to go to the nether and start getting some nether brick stuff from my fortress where I don't use it. And then I'll be back to do a little piston door. I'll show you guys what I want to do with the door. I actually have some designs. I was playing around with it yesterday, uh, trying to make one thick design so that I could fit it in quite nicely. Uh, and I did fall on a design I like, so that's good. I, I, I don't know. I've been playing Minecraft a lot more creatively though like in creative and just building things that I would never have built before but how we're gonna have this door here is it's gonna go in one like here I don't really like using unbreaking let's see if I have an efficiency pick uh, fortune efficiency unbreaking fortune 2 I have heaps of fortune 2's so it doesn't matter I'll use this it's gonna be like that and go in one and here's where the um god where the door will go here. Uh, there'll be pressure plates either here, I think, or here, depending. I think I'm gonna do it here. But the whole, like, this design isn't very big. Like, it shouldn't be very big, but I want the bottom to go in, and then the next part, and then the next parts, and then when it closes, the top, and then the middle, and then the bottom. 
Uh, and just to get that little extra part in, it actually makes it a bit bigger, so that really sucks, but I think I'll like it once it's done. All this will be nether brick, uh, the door will be nether brick too. I think that's actually what it's called. Let's have a look-see. Here it is. Yeah, nether brick. So yeah, I'll be back, guys. So I'm back from our nether adventure, and I have a lot of nether bricks. Uh, it should be enough to do our room. I don't really know how I want to do it. I kind of want to make it go down, like... But then again, I think it'd be cool just here. Maybe I'll make it uh, go like down one level and like this will be in the center of the room. And I, th I don't know, I, I want like a, a demon feel to it. Like, like it's a scary place. Um, but what we're gonna do now is make the little doorway I was speaking about earlier. Uh, probably should put away some of this because we don't need this much on us. Uh, so we'll put away this many, that. It's meant to have crystal over, actually I was meant to have her over tomorrow, um, but I don't, well that would be today by the time you guys see this, uh, but I don't think I'll be able to because I have to make a few videos tonight so that um, when she comes over I have content to upload for you guys because I don't, I don't like missing days, you guys know I hate that shit, it's depressing, it's like, oh missed a day, gonna hang myself. Alright, so now we're going to be doing the redstone part. Uh, so we'll pff, did that really stupidly. We'll put away some of the more of these because I don't need that much of it on me right now. Uh, we need some repeaters, a redstone torch, some redstone, more sticky pistons than that, uh, and some pressure plates. On the inside, I think I'll have a button maybe, or oh, I could have fence. Uh, oh no, I can't have fence gates. Alright, I've got an idea what I'm going to do. It's, it's going to be like a, a a bridge area, so like there's going to be a, a area I can stand on, and then there's going to be a button I'll push, and it will open a, the floor, and I'll be able to walk down there to the um things. I think that will work fine. Kind of like uh, in my nether portal, how there's an area I can um like push down, and the wall comes down, and then I can go through it. Hope you guys can picture what I'm trying to picture, but I don't feel like you can. Might, I might actually go a bit hard into this and um, get some TNT and blow up the ground. So it's re like a really deep cavern thing where this is. And like maybe have some netherrack coming on the walls so it's like you're slowly easing into death or something. And then maybe I could do this area a bit nicer. I don't really know just yet. But it sounds cool, doesn't it? I agree. I agree, Brenny. You're awesome. Speaking to myself before I typed hey to myself. Oh, it's not there anymore. I must have um, closed out the game for a sec Because I wanted to see how my name was spelt if it was with two capitals I couldn't remember and I was getting someone to write a plug-in for me So I was like I, I should probably spell my name correctly to them. All right, here we go. Let's get some sticky slime crap uh, someone asked me what the water under my face is that is my slime farm for the person that didn't know that um it, it needs to be fixed up right now because it's not efficient at the moment. It just is continuously putting out the um, uh, water so there's no time for slimes to spawn. But yeah, you can fix it up and it will work. So if you want to do that. There we go. Um, oops. Oh, really? What are you? I've noticed that. One side it's different to um, get blocks to place correctly. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna um, get out some more sand, what is it, stone bricks um, to put our redstone on. Someone left a comment on the previous video about uh, how like it's if I ever run into them, it's like serious. It's like, whoa, whoa, this is where some blocks are gonna be at. And I thought that was kind of funny. Uh, then I need to do this, I think. I can't remember how I had it, guys. Oh no, it was up one, it was like here there and then under here all right i'm getting there can't remember how i made this so bear with me um all right so that redstone went across the top into here which powered that block uh then there was a repeater here which went to here maybe and then there was oh how do i do it i can't remember i'll be back guys i'll go look at my design so if you guys didn't notice, I actually had the pistons too far forward, so when they extended, they were actually, the, the arm part was here, 
Uh, so to fix that, I had to bring them back one and I put the, uh, what is it? <laughs> Nether brick, I always forget. Uh, and doing so, when I bring it back, my uh, redstone actually bumps into here. So what we have to do is do a quick switch to put a uh, stone bricks there so that the redstone can fit through, but the lava doesn't leak out. So that's a quite an easy fix there. But now what we need to do is redo our little area. So we need to dig these ones and we need to get out our special brick again, which goes there and there. And then we have it like this, I believe. It doesn't seem right. Ah, oh, no, it's right. There we go. And that's how it is. Uh, now we need to put a repeater here, there, and up on the very top, which is hard to get to now that I have like my block blocked with a stair. So what we'll do is we'll do it like this. There we go. Redstone coming down. My bad. Redstone coming down here. And that seems like it. One, two, and three. Now we can put our special block down here and bring this down and we should be able to test it now. Uh, now I've done the other side, I've marked it out ready to go again. Uh, see, there we go guys, it goes from left to right basically, uh, that's how I want it, well wait, top to bottom, not left to right. I don't really know how I would explain it, but you guys should be able to see it. Alright, so we'll do the same thing on this side, there we go go uh, there like so redstone I feel like I'm there like so here we go I'm the number one rapper not really I'm an idiot I think yeah that's that's right that's good there and there that seems fine put a block down here awesome now we can do these together, uh, which is good. Th two and three, and there we go. Awesome, that's exactly what I wanted, guys. So we'll open this up and put these blocks here. Now we need to do the um, timing underneath. Now I have a little t extended timer thing that I made, um, which works pretty good. So that will be our time extending there. There we go go awesome so that looks really good i like that um i like it with the actual the sandstone too kind of looks like that but less fancy all right now we need to go dig under here which is going to take some time so i'll come back once i've dug out this area so i've dug out the whole area now i think that's how i'm going to start clips by the way again uh i usually start with okay guys but it's like now i'm going with so because it's it seems more eventful uh so we need to make these into uh our danger block because we don't want to um affect anything we need some redstone here um side we'll pick is this side so we'll dig this all out i had to i like broke too many levels down like i broke that one extra level down and i realized i didn't need to but then i realized i should have kept it a bit um broken so i can put these blocks here without digging it uh, i think i need two repeaters and then another block so that will go like that then we'll do the same on this side uh on my design in my creative world that i made that's because that's how i'm making this uh, the redstone opposites on either side, but I can have it on the same side and it will still run fine uh, I just have it on the other side on the other build because it looks nicer So we do this and That's my little time extender. It works really weird. I don't really get how it works um, Myself to be honest. Oh, I did that wrong didn't I didn't have to break all them either Idiot. There we go awesome and then we do that and now that should work once we place like a torch there. Oh God, I can't get from under here. So we'll place a torch here. Awesome, that looks awesome. Uh, now we need to connect them together. So that the, um, where, where will we have pressure plates guys? I think about here will be fine. I like it to be a bit back so that like when you step on it, it's not annoying. And what we'll do is we will have the redstone come up like this. So there and then there. 
Uh, no real reason to that, just I want to, because I think it will look nicer. Uh, let's get some stone blocks into here to fill up this hole. Dig that out. Fill in this hole here, like so. There we go, awesome. And that's it there. Now we can get out of here. And we'll just put some stone here. Awesome. Now when we go through here, this will be the block here with the redstone under it, wouldn't it? Oh, no, it's those blocks. I didn't see how it's those blocks. Wait, is this one? Hmm. Oh, there has to be an odd amount. All right, see how, um, because these are on that side, I assumed it was an even amount, but this one actually has to go back one more because uh, that's the center, center line there. So that's one space and then that. And from here, it just goes to straight there. Uh, so we'll do that there. There we go. Awesome, looking pretty. There's no real need to have this much redstone. I could have done. I could have done it like this, there, and then had this, like that, and then on this side I could have. We could have it opposite or the same way, like that. But it looks nicer with more redstone. It makes it look more efficient and professional. Whoop. I nearly died then. Well, I didn't die, but I nearly fell in. Don't know what I'm going to do about these side parts because they don't really blend that well. I might add some uh, stairs around here to make it look prettier. Oh, God, that looks awesome. There we go. It seems a bit delayed, though. Like, if I took this one out and this one out, would it open faster? It would should still be one direction as well, and it still should stay open for a while. So let's give that a shot. Yeah, see that stays open at the same time, it just opens faster. Alright, I'm happy with that. Um, so I think that's where we're going to end our episode, guys. I'm going to go show you the little tree farm that I did because I put logs around it. Uh, and then we can end the episode because this was a pretty fun episode. I had a lot of fun making this little doorway. Uh, the next episode we're going to have to do like a whole nether room uh, with nether water around it. And maybe even potions in the nether room. I thought that would be pretty cool. Or would you guys like to... Ooh, ooh, I've got some mad ideas. They just popped into my head, guys. I'm not going to reveal them, though, because it makes it more fun. Here's my little tree farm, guys. I really like it. Uh, it's got the block here, and then the wood, and then the block, and then the wood. Uh, but yeah, I like, I like this design for a tree farm. I think I need to bring these up by one, though, uh, just because sometimes I've accidentally broke them with the pickaxe. Uh, not with the pickaxe, with the axe. And if I have it one higher, I think they can grow uh, a bit higher without being large trees. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I'd appreciate it if you guys left a like and a comment. Um, let's leave a comment regarding that block of coal right there. What do you guys think of that block of coal? Not the ones beside it, just that one. Alright, so yeah, bye guys.